Because we are here today to talk about a very important issue, which is drug prices. Um, what's just happened and what's coming up in the next few months. So, as you know, for years and years and years, we have tried to get drug prices lower by allowing Medicare to negotiate with the big drug companies. Medicare has a lot of buying power. For many drugs, it's like 40% of the whole, um, the whole purchasing. So in a normal situation, Medicare would say, hey, we'll buy a lot of your drugs, but we want a lower price. But unfortunately, because of the power of Big Pharma, decades ago, long before I got to the Senate, it was written into the law that Medicare couldn't negotiate. One of my goals as majority leader was to change that. And we did in the IRA, the Infrastructure Relief Bill. And so right now, 10 of the most common drugs are, have negotiate, Medicare has negotiated the price of 10 of the most common drugs, and they're dramatically being lowered. And I'm gonna show you this chart, and let everybody take a picture. Let's make sure you guys in the press can get a copy of this. This is, can you all get it? I'll go to the other side too. But let me read some of them, okay? Okay, Aiden. Um, let me read some of them. These are the most popular drugs. Uh, we have Eliquis, which is used in blood clots. It was $521 a month. It's now $231 a month, 56% reduction. Uh, we have Xarelto, uh, that's for heart disease. $517,000 $517 a month, $197 a month. 